spoke with Campbell's wife, and her comments were nothing short of shocking. Oh no, he should have took more with him if that's the case. That's how I feel. That's that's God forgive me, but that's how I feel. If that's the case, he should have took more with him. If they was gonna stand over my husband and shoot him like a dog, he should have took all of them the out, and that's how I feel. Angelique Campbell said repeatedly that her husband didn't go nearly far enough in a shooting rampage that killed rookie cop Melvin Santiago. Standing next to an impromptu street memorial to the father of their six-year-old daughter, she expressed little sympathy for the murdered officer or his grieving family. Ms. Campbell also had no sense as to what prompted the 27-year-old ex-convict to commit an apparent premeditated attack on unsuspecting cops. Did he give you any indication uh, going into this as to what was No, I was asleep. I was asleep. I was asleep. I was asleep. Sorry for the officer's family. That's, you know, whatever. But at the end of the day, he got a family, too. All they care about is the officer. The, all they care about is the officer. Ms. Campbell echoed the anti-cop mentality of many we spoke with in that crime-ridden neighborhood today. Thank <laughs> you. 